support. You are ruddy, bloody, brilliant. And I hope that you enjoy this video. Sue, the maker 
those who fight during the intro to Street Fighter 2 actually have names. And they are called Scott and Max. Command and Conquer Red Alert was one of the first video games to be banned in China. Assassin's Creed was initially meant to be a spin-off of Prince of Persia. Snoop Dogg created an exclusive track for Need for Speed 2 Underground. Uh, a new remix called Riders on the Storm. The same guy behind Defense of the Ancients, or the wise known as Dota, created League of Legends. If you click the units enough times in Warcraft 3, they will get annoyed at you and start talking back. Donkey Kong 64's DK rap started as a joke between the game designers. Dogmeat, the canine companion in Fallout 3, was modelled off the dog in Mad Max 2. Nintendo's American branch was forced to offer gloves to everyone who bought a copy of Mario Party because of one mini game that required the spinning of the um, of the joystick, which basically caused blistering on your palm. Mass Effect was initially called Science Fiction X. Leonard Nimoy of Star Trek fame voiced much of Sid Meier's Civilization IV. At its release, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate was the largest crossover game in history. Japan was rumoured to have run out of 100 yen coins when Space Invaders was first released in 1978. The Pinkerton Detective Agency tried to sue Rockstar Games after the release of Red Dead Redemption 2, as it was an actual uh, detective agency. The handbook for Super Mario Kart actually re recommended players cheat and look at each other's screens to get an advantage. There are more than 17 million different usable weapons in Borderlands 2. The Sims was originally meant to be an architecture simulator. When Sonic the Hedgehog 2 was released in the United States, the English translation of the manual oversimplified the game's story. Pac-Man was nearly sold in the United States as Puck-Man. The first Battlefield game was actually created by just 14 people. Carrie Fisher, as in the one and only Princess Leia, voiced parts of Dishonored. There was a movie adaptation of Prince of Persia, The Sands of Time, but it's so awful that you really should just forget it ever existed. In 
Hideo Kojima used Lego bricks to help his team build Metal Gear Solid. And that's the halfway mark. Age of Empires 2 was re also released for the PlayStation 2. Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 2 was the first in the series to have a playable Marvel character. Oh yeah, apparently if you're 100% it, you could play as Spider-Man. Deus Ex may have predicted the destruction of the Twin Towers. Graphical limitations, they removed the uh, Twin Towers of the New York skyline in the year 2000. The 250th two player game played in the Mortal Kombat 2 arcade version launched a much older cla arcade classic instead. Uh, apparently, it uh, uh, kicked off a game of Pong. Metroid Samus Aran was originally meant to be a man. Doom's working title was Attack of the Attackers. Dota 2's lead developer is only known by the pseudonym Ice Frog. Super Mario World is Shigeru Miyamoto's favorite Mario game. Many of the characters in Undertale are named after fonts. Uh, uh, on the jovial skeleton sons, all of his dialogue is written in Comic Sans. Interesting. Among Us, Among Us, was originally called Space Mafia. Bloodborne is so hard that Sony's head of worldwide game development constantly emailed the developers for tips. If you play Rise of the Tomb Raider on February 14th, a special message pops up saying happy birthday Lara Croft. Despite ranking as one of the greatest NES games of all time, Mega Man 3 was a complete rush job. While Heroes of Might and Magic 3 got an HD remake, its expansions did not because the source code was lost. A remaster of GoldenEye 007 was meant to be released in 2008. Um, but apparently Microsoft hadn't actually uh, managed to get the rights from Nintendo to develop, to develop it. Useful. World of Warcraft racked up 5.5 million lines of code within its first five years. Scientists found that playing Portal 2 can improve your problem solving skills. Dark Souls developers completely trolled the game's players. How was this? Well, great, you can choose to start with several items. Oh, yeah, they added a, a pendant, which apparently did nothing. Bad Fur Day was originally meant to be another boring PG-rated 3D platformer. Uh, apparently the lewd themes came out three years into development. The idea for the 
secret cow level in Diablo 2 came from a hoax in the first Diablo game. Little Big Planet was originally called Craft World and its main character was Mr. Yellowhead. The first Worms game was created as an entry into a game development competition. There's a secret Star Wars reference hidden in Final Fantasy VI. soldier disguise and uh, the dialogue is aren't you a little short for an imperial soldier in reference to Princess Leia's quip in episode 4. The developers of Fallout New Vegas missed out on a huge bonus from Bethesda because the game's ratings were high enough. City and agreed to straight up payment instead of taking royalties. Oh, apparently they'd also got bonus if the game got a meta score rating of 85 or higher, which they missed out on by just one point. Monster Hunter World is Capcom's single best selling game. Tom Clancy's Splinter Cell Chaos Theory was banned in South Korea. A special edition of Uncharted 2 Among Thieves was never sold in stores. Uh, the Fortune Hunter edition uh, included a replica dagger from the game, an art book and a collector's case signed by Naughty Dog. And it could only be won via competitions. Plants vs. Zombies was originally meant to be called Lawn of the Dead. The Last of Us began development as a reboot of Naughty Dog's Jack and Daxter series. Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time has been the highest ranking game since its release in 1998. Multiple gamers have been sued for cheating in Fortnite and Battle Royale, with Epic Games cracking down on users who both cheated and publicized cheating, including a 14 year old. Cyberpunk 2077's developers were made to work brutally long shifts at least six days a week in the final months before its release. The Tetris theme song is actually a popular 1900s folk song called Korobaniki. than a million people downloaded Angry Birds within its first 24 hours on the Android market. Call of Duty Modern Warfare was the first Call of Duty to feature killstreaks. Metal Gear Solid 3 Snake Eater is full of David Bowie references. Disco Elysium, the final cut, is banned in Australia. Uh, yeah, doesn't actually say why. Dragon Age Origins has more than 900,000 words of dialogue. is a piece of cheese hidden in every single level of perfect dark. Grand Theft Auto 
San Andreas is the best-selling PlayStation 2 game of all time. The first edition of Minecraft was made in just six days. Back in 2009, titled Cave Game. Creators of Journey decided to remove voice communication to play to make players more cooperative. The first American Pokemon Go player to catch all 142 in the United States was given round the world plane tickets. A bloke called Nick Johnson. Every accessible building in Fable 2 can be bought. Um, yeah, apparently if you buy all the properties you become a king of Albion. Some of the characters in Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic were based on characters the developers played in tabletop RPG games. such as Salbar, Bastia, and Garth. There is an Overwatch League where players are paid a minimum salary of $50,000. The original Soul Calibur was the only game in the entire series that wasn't released on PlayStation. Woman who voices Resident Evil 4's Ashley Graham also did voice work for SpongeBob SquarePants. It was uh, Sandy Cheeks as well. The number 16 is everywhere in No Man's Sky. Apparently because there's 16 to the power of 16 planets in, the, in each galaxy. And then finally, the world record score in Doodle Jump is over 20 million. Wow. Well, that's a lot of Doodle Jumping. That is 100 video game facts. Hope you enjoyed this video. Hope it helps you to relax and unwind. And I'll see you all in the next video. So, lots of love as always, my friends.